Welcome to Finn, the Farnborough International News Network. We're here in our studio in Paris and uh, very pleased to be joined now by Yanni Sun from the Chengdu AOSSCI. Welcome to the Farnborough International News Network. Thank you. I uh, appreciate you being here as well because I realise that you've had an 11 hour flight and you've just arrived, so thank you very much for coming. Um, I want to talk to you about the next generation intelligent aircraft, the X-Hound. Yeah. And we've all heard about this, but can you explain for me the, the program and the process behind that? Okay. X-Hawk now is a uh, world leading kind of small size electrical uh, UAS. And uh, you know, from half a year ago, we have already uh, finished the core, two core technologies. That is vertical takeoff and vertical landing, which is half a year advanced of um, Google's project Wing, that program. So by now, this year, we have already delivered some products to our customers now. And you're very collaborative with your customers, I understand. Yes, yes. Um, our um, customers also focus on the, like the mapping, like the electrical um, instru uh, instru uh, infrastructure inspecting, and the security areas. Uh, consumer UAVs, of course. Uh, is there a demand for the uh, those unmanned systems in China? Yes, a huge demand for this kind of a small UAS, like like I mentioned, like the security areas, like the mapping, like the environmental protection. They need this kind of small UAS for them to uh, influence to improve their efficiency of work. And uh, there was some talk as well yeah. on, on an integrated uh, FMC, a flight management computer. Yes, yes. Did that take place? Yes, the M FMC is whole um, I, uh, research and development by our, ourselves. And uh, in the recent, maybe next year, we want to open resources to the world. And uh, some other companies, like they want to do this kind of small UAS, they can enjoy this kind of open resources. And uh, from our intelligence. Yes. Now, you say intelligence, it's innovation yes. as well, isn't it? Yes. What sort of value is China placing on the innovation and, and the new technologies and materials? You know, now the, we are in the era of innovation and uh, technologies. Now, innovation is very key for technologies, and uh, not, not only for China, but also for every big com uh, country. They, they, like America, they have a lot of policies. Like in China as well, we have a lot of policies to support this kind of innovation and the small size companies. Like we got um, policies to support like tax free and to support us to go to the world. Even we go to the f next year, we will go to FEM. Fenberg Air Show and the government give some our some support from the the finance support something like that. So the government is is very keen to make this a growing industry yes. in China. Yes, very keen. Like because innovation means the future, like the the AI this kind of technologies.